sixth grade, module two, lesson 12, problem set. Round to estimate the quotient, then compute the quotient using a calculator, and compare the estimate to the quotient. So the number one is 715 divided by 11. So 715, 700, I'm going to round, or 715, I'm going to round to 700, and 11, I'm going to round that to 10. So 700 divided by 10 is equal to 70. So that's our estimate. Now let's find the actual quotient. I'm going to go to my calculator and do 715 divided by 11. And I get... 65. So the actual answer is 65. So then we need to compare. So my estimate was 70. My actual answer is 65. So I would say that they're very close. So I'll say my estimate is very close. To the quotient. Okay, number two. I'll circle them in the different colors so we know which one's which. 7,884 divided by 12. I'm going to round 7,884 to 8,000. And 12, I'll round to 10. 8,000 divided by 10 is equal to 800. Now let's do the actual division problem on a calculator. So 7,884 divided by 12 is equal to 657. So if we compare that to 800, I'm going to say that it's kind of close. I mean, 657 is pretty close to 800. It's not thousands off, but it's about 150 off. So I'm going to say that it's close. Not really close, but it's close. I'm going to start just saying it's close to the estimate. Okay, number three. 9,646 divided by 13. I'm going to make that 10,000 divided by 13. I'm going to make it 10. 10,000 divided by 10 would be 1,000. So 1,000 is my estimate. Now let's do the actual division problem. So it was 9,646 divided by 13. I get 742. So it's equal to 742. And 742 is pretty close to 1,000, so I'm just going to say it's close to the estimate. Number four, 11,942 divided by 14. So 11,942, I'm trying to think of things that I can round both of these two that I can easily divide. So I'm going to make 11,942 into 12,000. And I can easily divide 12,000 by 10. So I'm rounding 14 to 10, and I get 1,200 is my estimate. If I do 11,942 divided by 14, we get 853. And 853 is kind of close to 1,200. It's not too far off, so I'm just going to say that's close to the estimate. 
So at this point, I'm just going to be saying it's very close to the estimate, it's close to the estimate, or it's not close to the estimate. Okay, number five. 48,852 divided by 15. 48,852, let's round that to 50,000. Divided by, uh, I can't really do 50 divided by 15 e easily, and if I rounded it up to 20, I also, it's not very easy to divide by, so I'm just gonna make it 10, because that would be 5,000. So my estimate's 5,000. And 48,825 divided by 15 is equal to 3,255. And that's kind of close to 5,000. So it's not super close. I mean, we're about 1,000 off. But so I'm just going to say it's kind of close to the estimate. Number six, 135,296 divided by 16. Okay, so again, I'm trying to make this into something I can easily divide by. So I'm gonna make it 140,000 divided by, I'll make 16 into 20 because I can do 140 divided by 20. 140 divided by 20 or 14 divided by 2 is equal to 7. If I cancel out a 0, I have three zeros left. So this, is, this estimate is 7,000. And if I do 135,296 divided by 16, get 8,456. And that's pretty close to 7,000, so I'm going to say it's close to the estimate. Number 7. 199,988 divided by 17. I'm going to make that 200,000 divided by 20. So I'm going to cancel out the zeros. 2 divided by 2 is 1, and then I have 1, 2, 3, 4 zeros. So that's my estimate is 10,000. Now let's find out the actual answer, the quotient. 199,988. divided by 17, 11,764. So I would say that's pretty close to our estimate of 10,000. Number eight. 116,478 divided by 18. Okay, so again, I'm trying to think what I could change these two so that I could divide them easily. I could change this to 120,000, and then I can divide that by 20. It's 120 divided by 20 is equal to 6. So I did 120 divided by 20, and then I'm just going to add three zeros. So my estimate is 6,000. We had 116,478 divided by 18. 6,471.
which is very close to 6,000. So I'm going to say very close to the estimate. Okay, number nine. 99,066 divided by 19. So let's make that 100,000 divided by 20. So if I do 100 divided by 20, I get 5. And then I have 1, 2, 3 zeros left over. So my estimate's 5,000. And 99,066 divided by 19 is 5,214. So that's very close to 5,000. And last one, number 10. One hundred eighty-one thousand eight hundred divided by twenty. Let's make that two hundred thousand divided by twenty. Or, actually, we can do one hundred eighty thousand. You could do two hundred thousand if you wanted to. There's not one right or wrong estimate. An estimate's just your estimate. But um, we'll get closer if we do one hundred eighty thousand divided by twenty. So one hundred eighty divided by 20, or 18 divided by 2 is 9, with, we have 1, 2, 3 zeros left. So my estimate is 9,000. And if I do 181,800 divided by 20, we get 9,090. which is very close to 9,000.